guys it's me blue sorry for disappearing again i've been kind of busy and you know stuff's been happening but um i recently got this adorable bean made by the wonderful fenny crafts you should totally check out her fursuits they're literally amazing anyhow so i got julius here and i was like hey i should make a video so that's what i'm doing and I feel like it was very fitting to talk about how I became a furry and how I entered this fandom. Um, so when I was little, I used to make pretend and play, um, like, you know, animals. Like, I would pretend to be an animal with, my, like, my friends. Like, I'm sure some of you have played pretend or house or whatever your version is. And I would always be an animal because, let's face it, humans are boring. <laughs> So, yeah, I mean, I didn't really know what a furry was, but I knew that, you know, being a dog slash cat and pretending was super fun. So, yeah, the first time I've ever heard the word furry was my mom telling me not to be one. Um, she heard some, like, weird furry horror stories about how awful they were or something or that they did weird things and was like, you know, D don't do that. <laughs> So, you know, flash forward to, like, 2016, I got really, really into FNAF, like, plushies, merch, theories, songs, you name it, I was into it, and somehow FNAF went into cosplay, and I got found out, like, FNAF cosplays, and, um, I was like, oh my gosh, a mango cosplay would be so cool, so I asked my dad to help me make one, and he said, sure. So we made a mango head. Um, we actually used a how to make a fursuit tutorial. Um, I can't remember who it was by, but it was like really old and stuff. So we used a fursuit tutorial to make a mango cosplay. And we wore her to um, WizardCon, I think. And it was a lot of fun. And I also got into Warrior Cat somewhere around then. And I was like, I can make my own characters? So I did. I made a lot of Warrior Cat characters. Um, I actually roleplayed my characters in, like, Roblox and Amino and all that jazz, and it was a lot of fun. So eventually, cosplay and my characters just kind of mixed into furry fandom, and somehow, like, my interests just combined, and I was like, oh my gosh, furries are cool, fursuits are cool, I can have a fursona, and that's how I became a furry, so yeah. <laughs> Sorry the video is really short, um, I was having trouble thinking of an idea of what video to make, so I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless, and, um, I'll see you next time. Have a good day, night, evening, morning, whatever time it is, and bye!